Built with ARM, AD-Link's AVA developer platform brings the performance, expandability, and energy efficiency of the ARM server into the hands of the developer. Automotive developers looking to develop level two plus to level four autonomous drive applications will feel right at home with Ampere's Ultra SoC. The system on chip features 32 processing cores uh, based on ARM's Neoverse N1 microarchitecture. Built alongside AD-Link's AVA AP1 platform for in-vehicle prototyping, developers will be able to migrate intuitively between the developer platform and the AP1 at any time. PCIe Generation 4 means that developers can make advantage of accelerators such as GPUs and NPUs via PCIe, and the generous memory capabilities means that there'll be no shortage of resource for complex mixed criticality automotive workloads. This demo is running AutoWare.Auto, an open source software framework for developing autonomous drive applications. The system is ARM System Ready SR certified, meaning it just works out the box with system images built for generic ARM targets. Those same images can be deployed in the cloud, which brings a huge value add to large teams looking to leverage cloud resources and infrastructure, such as continuous integration and continuous deployment technologies. This trifecta, the cloud instance, the developer platform, and AD-Link's AVA AP1, means the developers can migrate freely between the three systems with little to no friction and no concern for compatibility. This system is running ARM's automotive reference stack based on the SOFI architecture, SOFI being the scalable open architecture for embedded edge, meaning that developers can enjoy parity between working in the cloud and on edge devices such as this. This also enables full ARM-on-ARM -arm development, which is the first time that such a powerful system based on ARM architecture has been available for automotive developers.